Namaste ma'am. First of all, thank you so much for being with us today. All right ma'am. So you are uh, completely from a different art form like Satriya. It's very it's very unique for us. So uh, how did you start your dance journey? How did you start your career? At the age of 6 I have started my career. And Satya is a is a recognized as classical dance in year 2000. Okay. And since I am from Assam, I have started my Satya learning from six years. So just that that's it's, it's our lifestyle, na Satya. So it is a Vaishnava cult, and it is a living tradition also Satya. It is found in Mazuli and different parts of Assam. It is still it is practiced. Yeah. Right, ma'am. Then, what? Who were your inspiration or motivation? Is there any family members who do satriya art form or? No, because uh, at the very early I have started learning. Uh, from uh, that time, I think my parents have uh, taken me to the dance school so that there's like that i have started but after that my gurus inspired me my guru uh, jatin goswami sir padmasri nita charya jatin goswami sir and after that uh, i am just um, now i am learning uh, especially abhinaya from jayan kastwarji so they are now my inspiration Basically, when we start Bharatanatyam, learning Bharatanatyam, we initiate at the age of three, uh, six, and all, right? Uh, at present condition, it's almost six years, six right? Six years, yeah. So, at what age you started? I have started at the age of six. Okay. Do you think that it's very important for us to know at what age we should uh, start learning yeah, the basics? Yeah, yeah, and yeah, all? yeah, yeah. It's it's definitely because uh, at the, at if we if we start early then we can uh, develop our um, postures gradually. Oh, yeah. and then whenever we um, go at our different stages, we learn differently. Na? Yes. In the early age, we are learning the basics. Yes. So uh, it is uh, just now, uh, just that way we have our Anga Shuddha is going on. Yes. Whenever yes. We, are, when we get younger, then we can learn the basics. Okay, you have performed in out of the India and all? Yeah, no, no, no. No, no, no all no. right. Uh, you have been in to India. in other states, right? Yeah, yeah, in different states in, us, in all, India, yeah. All right, so uh, when you're going out of the state or when you're performing, uh, do you take any productions or do you take any pieces of like... Uh, Sometimes I have taken in some productions of mine, but uh, I have my own institution. Its name is Nupur Kalchal Academy, established in 1993. So I have many students and I have taken them with me in oh, different parts. Yeah. Great, great, great. Uh, do you find any uh, difference like when you're performing it's entirely different than when you are dancing right yeah, like yeah. Uh, do you uh, can you explain how the transition occurs like as a teacher the role as a mm. teacher and as a performer do you find any difference or difficulty no because i have started uh, my school in very early age at that, that time my age is 18 all right so i um, this is i don't find any difference as a teacher and uh, as a performer but uh, as a teacher i have uh, many many responsibilities yes definitely and that is the difference all right then um, you said about the your production can you explain something about your production uh, there are many production like lawanus uh, or means makhan uh, chor and the uh, Kaliya Daman, you know the Kaliya Daman snake? Yeah, yeah Kaliya yeah. Marthanam. So yeah. Kaliya Daman and like that. All yeah. right, all right. Man. And what about the Abhinayam uh, that you do in Satriya? Because it's not Satriya so familiar. Satriya Raj is based on Bhakti Rasa. Okay. So it is mostly on Bhakti. All right. So Dasya Bhakti is the main Rasa in Satriya. All right. So that's why it ends with Dasya Bhakti Rasa. All right. 
Okay, so Bhakti Raza is dominating in Satriya yeah, dance yeah. form. Yeah, All right, because Satriya is not so familiar here, yeah, so yeah, I'm yeah. so curious to know about it. And uh, what about the costumes? Costume we are used Assam silk, and color is also uh, nowadays uh, in the earlier time only white color is used, but now uh, different color is also used, uh, and it's a full gown dress. And um, Satriya, as I said, it's not so familiar to everyone, right? So, yeah. do you think there should be some kind of propaganda for uh, uplifting it or? Uh, uh, nowadays, Sangeet Natak Academy have did um, much for Satriya, oh, yeah. but still there is many. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right, ma'am. And um, do you do you do any workshops or? Any seminars in other yeah, places? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, we also, I also arrange many uh, workshops and seminars, and I also went to uh, demonstrate a satya in inside Assam and outside Assam. Satya is a classical art form of Assam, right? So, can you explain how it evolved, from where it evolved, whether there is any textbook for that particular art form? Like that? Satya dance, uh, it is. Uh, Sankardev Madhav Deji, Mahapuru Sri Manta Hankardev and Mahapuru Sri Sri Madhav Dev has started this art form and after that his connoisseurs, gurus, the Satradhikars has taken it to another level and it evolved from uh, um, Ankya Bhavna and now it is performed as a group dance and a solo dance also outside Satra oh. and in Sat within the Satras the uh, the monks, the Satya Bhokot, we, we tell them Bhokot. So they have performed this dance. Within the Satras, uh, women are not allowed earlier. Nowadays we can go and visit Satra, but the monks are mainly, most monks are the male. And they perform as a female also. All right. They wear okay, the they female dress the uh, uh, yeah, oh, okay. and perform uh, Hatya dance. But outside the Satras, we, uh, all the people can dance, oh, uh, all right. male, female and all the people can dance and inside the satra the duration is uh, whole day, whole okay. day they perform during the parba, matlab means uh, the festival time and uh, they perform whole day. All right. Uh, nowadays time is limited 10 minutes, 15 minutes, yes. whatever, whatever the, uh, the, the allowed the, uh, the and the performer and manage the time. Yes, yeah. yes, exactly. All right. Then, ma'am, uh, you have been to various states uh, for performance, right? So, uh, what do you think about the audience? Like, how they perceive this new art form? Audience, uh, like, mostly the audience like this form because uh, everyone want to learn what is this. Because uh, a few people only know about Hatriya dance. Though it is a classical dance, but a very few people know about Hotriya dance. That is why whenever we perform Hotriya, they came to our uh, class and asked me many, many questions. Uh, what are you doing? And uh, now just now you asked na, how it is evolved and all, all these things. So, and the Abhinaya, they can uh, understand. Yeah, understand because the same Abhinaya, that is Ram Bandana, Krishna Bandana, this is a Vaishnava cult. Oh, Though that is why only the Vaishnava practice is done here. Okay. Uh, so everyone can understand. Understand. The, uh, yeah, 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 Yes. And what about the music? Like uh, how? Uh, what all instruments are used? For instruments the are used in uh, such a is khol, okay. and the um, uh, vocal is borgit. We tell okay. this. It's my name is borgit. Okay. Uh, and uh, and the, all the uh, all the writings mm. of the of Sankar Devji, Madhav Devji, yes. uh, we are used yeah. used as a yeah. music. Uh, yeah. yeah, all right, ma'am. Then, um, do you think uh, this Satriya dance will be like one of the famous, like how we used to know about Bharatanatyam, mm. Kuchipudi, and I mean Kathak? We wish, we wish that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it is recognized in the year two thousand. It's too late. Oh, so that right. is why it's the last 22 years. Oh, all right. So, so it's so. a reason in the art form, right? Like mm -hmm. 2000 means it's kind of reason, right? Yeah, yeah. All right. That is why uh, all the people of Assam, all the dancers of Assam, uh, try to do this to make it uh, more familiar. 
Yes. Yeah. And um, do you find it uh, as a curiosity for performing in Kerala? Uh, because yeah, Madhusudan ji uh, asked me to perform here, Satriya. Oh, really? So I am. I want. I went here to perform. And mm. Very excited, also. excited. Yeah. <laughs> yes, because uh, I'm sure that uh, the people today's audience will not be aware of this art form, yeah, yeah, so yeah. Uh, they'll be more excited, mm -hmm. and even us. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, ma'am. Thank, Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much.